Hey everybody, welcome back. We are getting lined up to do a giveaway. How are you guys doing tonight? Everybody doing good? What's happening? Jesse, Jesse, Mark, Penny, Drake, Lion, EDC Life, Lion Knives, Caleb. Thanks for joining me, you guys. What's up, Earl? Fafafui. Women carry knives. Lady of the hour. Joseph, Dom, Debbie, Randy. What's up, Jesse? Mark, Kai Kai, Nick, Southern Edge, what's up? Whoop, whoop. So we are here for a giveaway. What's up, Rado? Rado's in the house. Deadpool, what's happening? Drake's. What's good, what's good? So we are doing a live giveaway tonight for women carry knives with regards to what's up Nick yeah with regards to her 1k giveaway that I was hosting she made it you guys made it happen like right away uh, I think probably before we even logged off what's up Winchester it was like bam she was at a thousand that's what we were looking for it was awesome so I'm excited I know she's excited it's going to be great. So let's see. I'm pulling up a website, a random comment picker, so we can get this going. But it's going to take me a minute. So I want to know what you guys were carrying today. Big time carrying. You know, I'll show you what I was carrying today. What's up, Paul? Robert? I was carrying my Benchmade bug out with the death grip scales and G10 and Micarta with that kind of sound wave ripple. Nice. You guys go. Oh, the TRM. Oh, the purple popsicle. Nice. So much so. The mini, mini sheepdog. Nice. He's got some good knives going out there today. No name UK legal multi tool. Hey, pliers are important, man. Gripper flat iron. Nice, nice. So awesome. So awesome. Mini grip and what else? Mini copper matrix. Ooh. Red carbon fiber TRM Adam. Nice, Dan. Have scales that kind of look like this. Yeah, I like that. So let's see here. I think I got to get logged back into this. It's one of those where you like get logged out and you're like, where am I going? Isaac, what's up, COD fan? No, that's good. Farron Forge Gent. Oh, Rosewood model. Left-handed PM2. Nice. What's up, Barry? How's Colorado doing? Terminus XR and S35, right on. Oh, you got the tactile turn, short, bolt, nice. Like one of these right here. That million, man, you just can't beat that million on there. No, that's cool, that's cool. I got to get my own video picked. I got so excited to get uh, logged in and go live and celebrate and get all this stuff given away. I was like, heck yeah. And then I'm like, uh-oh, <laughs> I need to get my other computer fired up. So let's see. We have one that's live, one that was streamed a day ago, and that's the one I'm looking for. So let me get the... 
URL of that plugged in. Copy link. We'll go over here. Okay, now you guys know what this is for. This is to celebrate. But prior to picking the random comment generator, one thing I'd like to do is talk about a couple things. Now, one of the things is you guys heard Big Red last night. And Big Red said, oh yeah, no worries, Drake. Big Red said, hey, I'm going to throw in a toucan if she gets to 1,200. Now, I don't think she's quite at 1,200, but we got a good start going. And so I, I talked to Big Red last night, and I was like, all right, Cauldron, I appreciate that. Well, I'll get moving on it here. But I talked to Big Red, and I was like, Big Red, what do you think if we rolled it over till Monday, let it go through Monday, get some more subscribers for Women Carry Knives? And he's like, I'm so with that. I said, but I need a backup plan. I said, if I don't, you know, if we don't reach our goal, if I don't reach my goal, and we don't get Christine Women Carry Knives to 1,200, what say you? And he says, you know what? I'm a big softy. He's got a big heart. You guys know that. He said, I'm going to make sure that toucan goes out anyways. So that was really, really cool. And then I get contacted by a good buddy, Chad, over at Southern Edge Knife Works. And he's like, hey, you know what? He is a big softy. Yes, indeed he is. Chad says, hey, you know what? Southern Edge Knife Works, we want to throw in a knife as well. Oh, Nick, thanks, man. I appreciate that. I, dude, I ordered some knives today for you guys for a giveaway. Eee, it's going to be awesome. Uh, so that goes all towards that. So thanks, Nick. But I basically, Chad from Southern Edge Knife Works, he goes, you know what? We're going to throw in a carbon fiber Spyderco Chaparral. Just straight up. No problem. It's a great cause. He wants to support women carry knives as well. And he's like, you know what? Let's do it. So... Southern Edge Knife Works, this is going to go right here. I'm going to throw that sticker in. I'm sure he'll throw one in as well, but I'm going to send one of mine out with this giveaway because Big Red and Southern Edge Knife Works didn't have to do that because we'd set an original goal, but they're like, dude, we love the knife community. We'll take care of business. So don't forget to support Southern Edge Knife Works and use Zach15 as your discount code when you go to check out, free shipping in the U.S., uh, $15.99 for international shipping, and it all goes back to us. So I don't get I don't get any money off this. I don't get anything like that. But it just supports the community. So that's that's what I like to support. If it supports the community. I'm in. So we got that out of the way. Let's pick a winner because I know people are waiting. So and then I'm going to show you guys a couple cool things that came in the mail. I can't wait. So anyway, so here we are. We have the YouTube entered. I'm going to do it one more time, but it looks like there's 83 unique comments. So that's good. 83. Let me double check that. That seems low. Let me double check the video real quick. I want to make sure I get the right one for you guys. We have that one. Oh yeah, that's that, that's about right. That's about right. Yep, yep, cuz I commented on some of them. Other people commented. So, yep, that's perfect. It's about right. Yeah, it was a live from yesterday. Oh, thanks, Nick, dude. I appreciate that. So, we're going to pick another one. Sorry about the light there. Get a little reflection. See the blinds. It's all good. So, we're going to pick a winner. Good luck you guys. Here we go. Yeah, wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> uh, therapeutic Edge wins. Like, oh. So here we go. Good luck to whoever wins. Hopefully you're here live. That'll be so awesome. Bad Monkey. Woo. Tell me Bad Monkey's here. Tell me he's here. Man, all I got to say is you guys are awesome. You guys are awesome. Now, there will be another giveaway on my channel this week. 
that I'm going to do for my 5,000 giveaway because I just hit 5,000 because of you guys. So thank you so much. 5,000 subscribers is amazing. I'm, man, I'm so happy. So, Bad Monkey, congratulations. Thanks, Calder, and I really appreciate you hanging out, man. Come back and watch so you can see some of the cool stuff that I, that I show and that came in the mail. So anyways, thank you so much. Nick, thanks, man. I appreciate that. Bad Monkey, you got to watch this. Please contact me. We'll get you hooked up. And don't forget Southern Edge Knife Works. Zach 15 gets you 15% off. Free shipping in the U.S. International shipping is going to run you $15.99. I have to say that because it's a deal for all of us. And I've got to order my own this week. So, Women Carry Knives, thank you so much for being an awesome part of the community. Um, I can't say enough how much I enjoyed meeting you guys and spending time with you. I, I now know that I need to like book my own party room for Blade Show West next year. And hopes that so many people come down and we just have like a hangout party one night for ourselves. That'll be awesome. So I'm going to put this stuff off to the side. We'll get it set over here for Bad Monkey. That is so awesome. But I want to show you guys a couple things that came in the mail. This is awesome stuff. I'm excited to see what comes out of Christine's channel because... You know, she's got, she's got that, uh, you know, that opinion that matters for women. So yeah, thank you guys. Thanks, Penny. Yeah, it was so awesome to hit that. And I hit it like last night, I think. I think it was last night. No, it was first thing this morning when I got up. So I was pretty stoked today at work. So, oh, thanks, Therapeutic Edge. Yeah, I mean, I can't wait. I can't wait to hang out with you guys again. If I was closer, I'd drive down. But I got to take some time off work and take me a few days to get down there. So yeah, okay, so let's see a couple things that came in the mail. I'm going to show you guys a sticker, see if you guys can figure out where it came from. It says right on it. <laughs> oh, nice, it's on your 250, right on, right on. So here's one of the cool things. Now, I'm going to take this out. I don't know, I probably don't have any gloves here. It's just going to get dirty from my oily hands, but... Here is something. Now, I showed you the backspacer on my other knives. And, of course, I didn't bring it with me. Oh, no, it's right here on my purple one. So I showed you the backspacer that I have. I got the black one, which I was really excited when he came out the black one. Oh, thanks, Keith. And basically, this, this geared backspacer from Rockscale Designs, it's great for the bug outs. He's got a smooth, flat one as well. What's up, Hayden? Yeah, definitely stay tuned for Women Carry Knives. She'll be doing a giveaway. So, yeah. So, anyway, so I got this backspacer, and I got contacted by Rockscale. And he's like, hey, man, I want to send this out to you. And I want you to toss it on one of your knives and let me know what you think. And it's a new titanium one. And here, we'll throw purple out there to you because I know you guys like purple. Um, but... I'm waiting for the, the backspacers for the mini. That would be sweet, too. But he sent this out, and it's his new, like, Timascus. So it's not just anodized, but it's, like, Timascus. And it's so beautiful on the sides. And then you have your layering. I don't know if you can see the layering there and your colors there. But beautiful. And he sells these on his site, rockscaledesign.com, right here on his sticker. And he usually posts all his new stock every Saturday at like noon Pacific. So, but yeah, just gorgeous. So now, yeah, thanks, Nick. Uh, bug outs temp on the secondary market. If you have like a regular uh, original bug out, like a 535 on the secondary market, you, I've seen these go for like 75 bucks. Something like that. Or maybe cheaper. Depends on how beat up they are. I mean, this one's been tossed off a building and all sorts of stuff. Second story. Ran over all sorts of good stuff. And it's still working great. But anyway, so now i got to find a knife to put this in. And swap out one of them. So, I mean, I could probably put it in here to give it some color pop. That would be kind of cool on this purple one. But I might, I might do the red one. I don't know. I have a couple bug outs that it would probably look good in. Has a little too much blue maybe for the red one. 
But as you guys know, I do have a quite uh, extensive uh, collection of bug outs to choose from. So I will be doing a separate video on this, but I wanted to show you guys because it came into the mail and it's just beautiful. It's again, it's the Timascus, and it's hard to show exactly on camera, but the layering on this is just beautiful. So I wish that that stuff would show on the, I wish you could see like the whole thing, but I get it. You know, it's got to have some sort of functional purpose, but just gorgeous. So that's one thing that came in from rock scale design. Amazingly beautiful. What's up, Rosa? Welcome from Florida. Nice to have you here. Not yet. He's working on the mini and also the bailout because people are wanting to do a like a pommel delete. So he did a pommel delete for the other ones. And now he's going to do a pommel delete for this one. So some people that get this aluminum bailout, the new one, the handles are amazing. And then people are like, man, it would be great if I didn't have that window punch or have an option to just not have the window punch. So, you know, you take one side of the scales off and then unscrew the other one underneath this clip and you can take that pommel off and put a new one in. So what's up, Ohio? A brass one. I don't know on brass. He usually does the titanium. And so, yeah, so usually the titanium ones. Every once in a while I've seen him work on some aluminum stuff, but Mainly it's all titanium. Uh, old used sharpener? Not that, it, not yet. I've still been using the work sharp. And that's one thing that you'll see this week, uh, probably by the weekend. I'll try to get it done sooner, but I'm squeezing it in every day after work, all my stuff, because I got to get caught up. So, oh, and thanks, Nick, dude. I appreciate all your support, man. Nick is like an awesome, awesome subscriber, like you all. But very supportive. So it goes right back to you guys. So it supports you guys. So that's the best part. Now, something else that came in. This is from our friend Randy. You see him on here, Randy F. Dividend ordered. Nice. Now, Randy was nice enough to loan out a knife of his to a couple of us. Yeah, auto bailouts. That would be sick. Now, this is a knife that I probably would not have purchased myself. Comes with some poison for the trolls. Shout out to my guy, Flossie. Um, but look at this. You know, you've probably seen it on Big Red's channel. But Flipper, it's like an assist. I think this one's the Knockout, an M390. And the blade has a beautiful, like, kind of a black wash to it. But it's also still got, you can see some of the grinds on there. Now, I've, I've never had or held one of these knockouts, and it's it, like, fits my hand perfect. You know, I have a large glove size hand. It's just, wow. And it's thin. You know what I mean? It's got a thin profile. So, I don't know. I mean, this one, I got to look up some history on them. Um, but these knockouts... I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna probably get one of my own now. <laughs> Thanks, Randy. But you know, frame lock. I gotta look up the price on these. I don't think they're terrible. I wanna see their I wanna think they're in the hundred dollar range, but I'll have to go back and look at that. I apologize, I don't have that. I'll have to look it up really quick. You're buying one? I dude, I'm serious. And especially this blue, it's like a it's a machined aluminum is what it feels like, but it might be titanium. Oh, 110, 105. Okay. And I don't know if this is something that maybe uh, Southern Edge Knife Works, if this is something you guys carry or you guys can pick up. Oh, I know, Nick. I'm sorry. But this is, you know, we can thank Randy for this one because this one's actually beautiful. It's got their speed safe. But I'll tell you what, I, I'm blown away by it. So some initial comparisons. I mean, size-wise, there's the Super Freak. Aluminum scales, okay. Oh, it's a subframe lock, okay. Yeah, I liked, I really like it. I like just the whole combo. To me, this is like a knockout. And it's got a pretty decent deep carry clip. So, okay. Can pick up, have the OG one on the site. Okay, nice, there you go. So if you want, uh, email, would that be the best? 
email Southern Edge Knife Works. Maybe we'll get it on there and, and ship it out to you guys. Hola. And it's got thumb stud deployment too, which is just as snappy. So nice. Yeah, Hayden, the giveaway is, is finished. It's wrapped up. Our buddy Bad Monkey won, which is kind of cool, but it's, I was bummed that he wasn't here. I think, Nick, he said that if you email him uh, from his website, or he might post his email here, he will go ahead and order it for you. So be good to go. But Randy, if you're watching, if you're here, thank you, my friend, so much. Oh, yeah, OG's in your rotation. Man, I don't know what to say other than this one changed my mind on Kershaw. So... I mean, quality materials, beautiful looks, beautiful action. Um, you know, I have my original, you know, stuff I've got from Kershaw, but just haven't like leak and stuff, but I haven't, you know, used or purchased many more. So yeah, so let's look at something else that came in this week. Okay, nice. Yeah, and this is American made, you know, it's even got, uh, I think the flag on there, right there. So a lot of, you know, a lot of billboarding, they love that, but it's all good. At least, you know, at least the, the blade's got a really nice wash and finish to it. A bare knuckle. American made's pretty sweet. Now this is one I'm going to show you. Just picked it up. I'm trying to collect, I'm trying to get the smaller one, but I haven't been able to find a smaller one. I'm trying to find a smaller one of these. So if you guys have a, a, a lead on one, once you see it, let me know. But this one's a classic from Benchmade, the Hunt series. Look at that. Just gorgeous. Now, I found this one. It was used... We got a pretty decent deal. The wood's in really great condition. There is some rust you can see on that on that lock bar. So yeah, exactly, Radio, the Summit Lake. So this is the large size. And you can see in my large size hand, I mean you got plenty of room. But I want to get the small as well. Because I make a smaller one. <laughs> These are all ones that have come in the mail, you know, that I've picked up through contacts through collecting um you know i and this one I'll, I'll definitely be taking it apart and doing some cleaning back here so you can see some of the dirt and stuff and a little bit of rust so i'll get some got some really good products clean that up with but yeah lockup is tight the wood's in great amazing condition got the beautiful split arrow clip so if, if you guys know of a small one out and about in the wild let me know because I want to get a small Summit Lake one. Beautiful. Okay, now one last thing that came in the mail. And this will be a probably a project video that you'll see. Let me get it opened up here. It's still in the in the package. Just picked it up tonight. Haha. <laughs> I know, Mark. Thanks. I appreciate it. So I ordered some stuff from some good friends of ours over at three rivers manufacturing now you know me i'm a patch fan so i'm like i had to order a patch so ordered a patch got that dialed up had to order something oh that's nice hopefully my knife will fit in there that looks like it make sure there's nothing else i missed i thought they'd throw me in a couple stickers but maybe not nope no stickers that's okay though Yeah, so I picked up a pouch. This is a small pouch from TRM, Three Rivers Manufacturing. And nice felt padded on the inside. My TRM Atom is supposed to fit in there very nicely. I hope it does. <laughs> Just barely, but it fits. It is their York Yorkie, yep. So it's pretty awesome stuff. I mean, if you guys haven't seen this, you'll be seeing a review coming up on it. But I wanted to get... Not only these two things, I want to get the patch, I want to get the pouch as well, but I wanted to get, because TRM did something really cool. 
they sent me out another set of scales with mine when I ordered it from them. And they sent me out some micarta. So I have a set of micarta scales as well for it. And then some of you guys had some beautiful, amazing things. And once I got this red carbon fiber in hand and that texture, I was like, holy cow. So I had to order the blue ones. Now, I don't know which one I'm going to decide, but woof. This blue's got the same texture. It's like a carbon fiber G10 blend mix scale, and it's just beautifully amazing. Yeah, so, I mean, that's going to be my dilemma, you know? I originally ordered it, and then I'm like, dang. I had What I did is I had one of those, like, Visa gift cards from from something, and I was like, all right, I can spend it and buy that. <laughs> so, anyways... That's going to be my dilemma on these. You'll see a review coming up soon. Thank you to TRM for sending me the original skit of Micarta Scales. It'll be a three-way tie, and we'll see which one ends up on this one for the review. So, But anyways, these are pretty awesome. My buddy over, my buddy Ray over at Everyday City Carry, he just posted his review on the TRM Atom with the uh, red Micarta. So anyways, yeah, so those just came in. They're pretty, pretty awesome knife and everything and if you don't yeah i could do both one on each side i just wouldn't be able to do either the micarta or the red so if you guys have any need or want to get any of these trm knives they sell them and kind of drop them in in i guess groups when they do their you know building so they'll make you know a run of them they'll drop them on their website and they're usually gone pretty quick. But if you sign up on their website, they will email you, let you know when they're coming up. So pretty cool. Uh, I picked up this one as well. I think the patch was like 10 bucks or something. So this is going to go up on the patch wall tonight. Uh, you'll see that on my Instagram. But yeah. So anyways, you guys got any questions or anything? I'm just trying to show you what came in, show you what's coming up on the channel this week. Uh, I got some stuff from Southern Edge Knife Works coming up this week on the channel. Some pretty cool stuff. You saw that. About a week ago in my video and don't forget the discount code on southern edge knife works zach 15 gets you 15 percent off 15 percent off and all the good stuff free shipping in the u.s eating cheese puffs cherry coke chilling with zach stuff life is good that sounds like an amazing evening that is fantastic do i have any bench made for sale I never really post a sale up. I mean, if there's something you're looking for, you can always message me or email me or something. I'm trying to get caught up on emails this week and get all my shipping out. Oh, Nick, holy cow, man. You are very kind, my friend. OP. <laughs> you're Nick, too. That is super nice. Thank you very, very much. Ribs are ready. Six hours in the smoker. You should have told me like six hours ago. I could have hopped a flight. They're pretty cheap now. Benchmade Boost. I have some Benchmade Boosts. I don't know if they're with me right now. I was trying to look at my, my stack of knives. Yeah, the ribs sound good. Yeah, exactly. Therapeutic Edge is like, ribs? All right. <laughs> oh, Keith, thank you so much, brother. Thanks for all you do, man. I know you're still working a whole bunch, probably extra right now. I really appreciate you doing what you do and taking care of us. Oh, you're doing brisket tomorrow, Chen. Nice. Very nice. So, yeah. So, I had one other question. I know we looked at uh, voting on these. Um, what do you think about me making some bigger orange stickers? I might make some of these in, in a bigger style. Cause I had the I had the solid Z's right here, but they didn't go over so well with everybody. I mean, I'll put them I'll put them in my giveaways and stuff, but they're kind of plain. Oh, you're finally going back to work. Okay, oh, you like the black OG ones? All right, nice. Landscaping's essential. People are like, man, my lawn's going crazy. Yeah, it's just okay. That's what I thought. I like the design of it, but it just doesn't say enough, you know? It doesn't 
give me any real identity. So I'm trying to build, I like the design of that Z, like I kind of like the outline and the font, but I'm trying to build on that. And I've actually, I've put this on, I've put this exact one on my, a couple knives I have. So that's been pretty cool. Uh, my friends over at Benchmade, when I've picked up a couple of the knives, they've actually laser marked them for me with that little Z on it, which has been pretty sweet. I was trying to see if I had any of those with me right here. Not the purple one, but it has a big one on it. Purple one has a big Z on it. And then I've kind of transitioned to a little Z that would just kind of goes up there or on the side. Yeah, man, just send me an email or send me a message on Instagram. <laughs> Thanks, Deadpool. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. Yeah. I mean, I've been on for about 30 minutes, so I think Nick's got the award for the the Do Kindness Award. Show them some love. But yeah, you guys are awesome. And I'm so excited. Bad Monkey won the giveaway. Christine's rocking over a thousand now. Yeah, that's perfect. Well, cool. Well, if you guys don't have any other questions, we can rock out of here. But if you guys have some questions, I'm cool to stick around for a little bit and answer some questions and flip some knives with you guys. Yes, Chris. Yes. <laughs> that's, that's the other part of like, everybody's like, yeah, Chris is like, dude, you can jump off. It's all good. Thanks, Nick. I appreciate it, man. So I, I do have the Z logo, but I'm trying to build on it. Christine, I'm trying to build on this logo so I can kind of get like a little more out of it, you know? Cause like if I post that somewhere, people are going to be like, okay, it's a Z. It almost looks like a generic Z that comes up. Like if you don't have any artwork on your YouTube channel or something else like that. DIY projects. Yeah. I'm thinking about changing this mini bug out over, you know, I changed this one to purple. I've seen some beautiful ones out there. I saw Hitch and Timber did a really nice, like, forest green that looks amazing and then there's been a couple people that did blue uh saw somebody that did red um thinking about maybe doing a pink version as well but i gotta wait till a couple of these come in oh randy thanks a bunch man thanks again for loaning me this knockout i'm gonna order one because it's a beautiful nick no i wish that proper is so beautiful i've tried to i <laughs> I tried to go in before all the, the stuff went down with everybody getting sick and whatnot and uh, stores closing. I tried to go in and be like, hey, man, you got any discount codes for uh, that new proper? I know. I would love that proper. I'd carry it, too. I got some beautiful. I'd probably buy a new one, but I got some beautiful uh, proper slips from Hitch and Timber that I've ordered. Probably seen them my other ones. Whoops. Hilltop, what's up, man? Yeah, we got uh, Christine over a thousand. We did a giveaway tonight. Our buddy Bad Monkey won, so Bad Monkey's gonna be rocking some gear here shortly. Have a whole setup, and then uh, Southern Edge Knife Works threw in a carbon fiber chaparral, and Big Red threw in a toucan. So it's pretty good, pretty awesome. Everybody supporting women carrying knives, so. Oh, he did? <laughs> He's not here. We got to invite him. But no, I'm just pretty excited that somebody won that is active in the community, active on our channels. Oh, your KPL is in the mail. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Macarta for the mini bug out. I have not seen Macarta for the mini bug out yet. Yeah, there's lots of craziness going on right now, so... Bit, you know, everybody being cool. I, you know, I tried to watch some videos the last couple days. Had a date my first day off yesterday. Try to get caught up, and just you guys are amazing out there. You know, I've I've watched several videos of people in the community that, you know, you guys support and leave comments on their channel and interact, and it's pretty cool. So, I know, I knew he just won something. That's the thing, you know. Everybody, it's it's pretty awesome. So. 
Hey, Hilltop, just send me an email or send me a message on Instagram. I got a list I'm working through. Um, about halfway through getting everybody some stickers sent out and stuff. Ohio, thank you, thank you. Got your message, thank you. And uh, yeah, I'll get them out to you guys this week, so definitely cool. But yeah, if you guys, I don't know, you guys probably aren't patch people, but I like this patch. I mean, their dog's holding their one of their knives, looks like an Adam. It's their tycoon. Oh, Michael. Man, we'll, we'll say some prayers for you, man. Your spidey chef. Heck yeah, dude. Be like, hey, if y'all need a sharp knife, it's right here. Yeah, so I picked this one up. I think it's like 10 bucks on their website. I picked that one up as well as a, a pouch for my knife. Nice and stitched on there. TRM. Nice and padded and felt. Good quality. And then, of course, picked up the blue carbon fiber scales as well, which are gorgeous, so... We'll see which ones end up on there. But I had I had a, one of those gift cards. I'm like, and that was, and it was still available because some of those those like Macarta ones and stuff they went quick when they when they did a run of new scales. So I really dig the people over there at at, at Three Rivers at TRM. They're really really cool. So and then Randy loaned me his knockout, so I'm gonna end up buying one of those. We'll see how payday goes Friday. Be like, <laughs> be like, hmm, got that knockout. I mean, you can't beat it. I mean, M390, it's just amazing. So, oh, Nick, thanks, man. You've been so kind tonight. Thank you so much. It's not bad. All right, Earl, I really appreciate it. Thanks for joining. It's not bad. You know, this, like I said, this isn't, this isn't one that like I've ever used before. And I'm not usually like one of the things you'll learn on my other uh, review of the TRM is I'm not, I'm not usually, or the Adam, TRM Adam, I'm not usually a liner lock fan, you know, but this one is just, man, it changed my mind. You know, I'm uh, being a Benchmade guy. I'm like, you know, an axis lock fan to the like 10th degree. So that's me, you know, like give me a big knife with an axis lock, keep my fingers and my thumb out of there. Just fidget with it all day long. And of course put some red thumb studs on it. But to me, you know, I mean like this one too, you know, changing my mind. What did you guys have any uh, thoughts on the subframe locks? I'd be interested to hear just because this is first for me. <laughs> Nick, thanks, man. Appreciate that. I'll be like uh, picking up one of those knockouts here next month. Maybe I'll do a giveaway with one too. That'd be sweet. I always like finding new knives like that. And if, if Randy hadn't been so generous to be like, hey, I'm going to send this to you because I think you'd like it. You know, that's how I ended up with uh, a southern grind knife, you know. What's up, Cigar Sarge? You like them? Other than the bare knuckle. Huh. A lot of hard times with the bare knuckle, huh? You can't stay off the lock. Yeah, and maybe it's this one because this one's a... Uh, this one's a, you know, has their speed, is it speed safe? So I'm not having to like put much pressure right here. You know, I can just like grab and flip that way. But yeah, I got, I got this, a couple of those Southern grinds. And of course, you know, Slicey Dicey got me involved in those. Cause I started watching them and, uh, <laughs> Nick doing the matching. That's cool. I like the matching, but we're doing, uh, you know, the Southern grind. And all of a sudden I'm like, all right, I got one. I'm like, Oh, okay. This is pretty nice. This is pretty nice. And then all of a sudden it's like, I started using it. I'm like, this is really nice. And then I'm like, dang. So yeah, so I had to get like two or three more, of course, because they started coming out with different variants. And then you're like, you can't just get one and not get the one with, you know, blue or red or, you know, carbon fiber. Then they started coming out with like copper and all. And I'm like, oh man, I got to stop somewhere. 
And luckily, Benchmade came out with some new knives, and I'm like, oh, I got to save my money for some Benchmades. So, but there's an the orange mini. Which a lot of people said doing a blade swap would look cool. Put the black blade on that. You want to see the gold class mini crooked? Oh, I'm going to have to go to the other room and grab it because I don't think I brought that with me. If you don't mind waiting for a second, I'll run and go grab it. I think it's locked up nice and safe in my safe. But yeah, I have no problem grabbing it. Grabbing that one and I'll grab a few others that I have over there. Cause that one's gorgeous. And I'm thinking about doing that uh, open tag from Slicey Dicey too, the beauty pageant. I think I have a couple candidates for that. Oh, nice, Chris. You bought another one. <laughs> Thanks, Nick. Okay, hold on. Let me grab it real quick. Party people in the house. Okay, what did I miss? All right. What's up, Jerry? Bunzo, yeah, we got it. Okay, so you wanted to see the mini Crooked River gold class. So let me make some room. Let me get some of this out of the way. We'll move this purple one. And I'm serious on the Summit Lake. If anybody finds a small version of that, send me the link or something. I'm trying to find track one of those down. Saw one on eBay, but it ended up going for quite a bit. And I wasn't like wanting to pay that for a used one, but... Oh, no box. Okay. What's up, Mark? Well, BC's in the house. Very nice. So this is a mini Crooked River from Benchmade. It's the gold class. It is gorgeous. Exactly, Rado. Bad monkey. Big Daddy in the house here tonight. Now, this is one of my favorites. I've carried it a few times already. Didn't do any hard work with it. But just look at the blade pattern. Damn steel blade. Bad Monkey, guess what, buddy? You are a winner, my friend. Winner, winner, winner. What's up, Ty Addiction? I mean, all the accents tie in together. They're all the same color. Thumb stud, barrel spacers, pivot ring. Got a little bit of smoke um, coating on your liners. Like a PVD nitrite coating or something. It's a beautiful one. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, Bad Monkey, congratulations, man. You won tonight. So hit me up. Send me a message. You won the giveaway pack. Thanks for supporting Women Carry Knives. Thanks for supporting my channel. I hit my 5,000 this morning first thing. It was pretty, pretty awesome. So kind of a good day all around. Uh, a lot of work to do at work, but I couldn't wait to get here and do a giveaway for you guys. So pretty awesome. 
Yeah, Nick, you know, that was one of the things. Like, I think I, I left the box in the room, but, you know, box-wise, it was like a uh, standard size box, you know? It's like, and then it wasn't the only one. Thanks, Hilltop, I appreciate that. You know, but I think even the proper comes in a, in a full-size gold-class box. So I think they figured it out. Yeah, you're welcome, definitely. If you need some pictures or something, just send me an email or whatever. But I did a video on it, so it's pretty cool. I mean, sharp as all get out. And the, the carbon fiber is just gorgeous. I mean, it just shines. You know, every different type of light. And then this, you got your Refure. I think it's a Refure Noble. But there's a different name to this one as well, I think. Of Refure. Just like do the, the shark pass. <laughs> yeah, of course, of course. Had to get some beautiful knives out. Can't go wrong with the 20th anniversary 940 Osborne titanium S90. Another fantastic knife this year. Kind of waiting to see what the next 940 is going to be. I, I, I know they got to do another one at least. Yeah, exactly. And then you got, for you guys that just came in late, Rockscale Design sent me this. Um, and basically, he wanted me to show you guys. It's his new Timascus. Do I have a favorite Benchmade? I mean, the Timascus Larian is beautiful. It's hard to see on the end. But just gorgeous. Yeah, exactly, Nick. 940 is like my favorite. So if I had to go down through it, oh, which 940 is my favorite, favorite? Yeah, totally. I like the all one piece because you know how the Crooked Rivers do the, the bolster usually separate and how this one's all one piece. It just and has the, the inlay is just beautiful to me. Ah, man, the, the best 940. Yeah, I, I mean, the the new proper is just gorgeous, you know. I really like the one they had, the, like that pearl one they had like two years ago. And I almost bought that one, but I was like, you know what? I'm going to wait, you know, and it's still out there for the same price about. Thanks, Penny. I appreciate your support, definitely. I appreciate you supporting Women Carry Knives, too. Yeah, it's a great combination of old and new. And I think one of the things... I grabbed one of my bags here, my knife bags. It's got some of my my favorite 940s. I mean, you guys, hopefully you've seen this one. What's up, Tom? This is titanium from Rock Scale Design, titanium scales. And you can see that kind of that belly to the scale itself. And then yeah, I put one of his backspacers in there, which I've been wearing the Anno off because I've been carrying it so much. But that's a nice one that he did. Uh, let's see. What are the other ones I like? I don't know if I could pick a favorite though. Cause I really like the damn steel blades. I wish I could build one. You know what I mean? Build one in a, like a, you know, Benchmade's custom knife builder. <laughs> but this is kind of the progression for me. You know, this is what I'm talking about. You know, you get some hitch and timber pocket slips start carrying your propers, you know, and for me, you know, you got S90V and carbon fiber. It's just, I mean, you can't beat it, you know, only one I'll probably have to put a lanyard on. And then this is one, I took one of the blue propers and got some G10 from Rogue Blade Works. Some G10 scales and kind of made an all blacked out version. Black hardware. It's got the original black uh, spring bar. It's kind of sweet. So it kind of goes nicely with this one. You just kind of make it an all in one. With the they did this limited edition red leather. Put a little polka pen in there. Paka polka, polka pen. So yeah, that, I would love to do that and get that proper. That proper would be woof. That's one of I think that's one of my grails. That's one of my new grails. 
But it's only going to be available this year because I think they may only made like 250 of them, I think. I'd have to look on their site, but. Man, I really appreciate it, Nick. Thanks for all your support. Seriously, that's awesome. But yeah, that would be one of my grails, I think, is getting that getting that in there, that new proper. I'll have to like, I think I'll just have to hammer down and see what I can do to work a deal. Maybe I'll get a hold of one of the dealers and be like, hey, what type of deal can you get me, dealer? Because <laughs> it's hard, you know, like even, you know, you get, you know, employees for Benchmade, you know, they can't get, they can't get those much at all. You know, that stuff's all out to the dealers super fast. So I think they have like one or two in the store, but the store's closed and you pay full retail on it. You know, they don't mark it down because they don't want to compete with the dealers. So there's some local dealers in town. I might have to reach out to them, see what's going on. But yeah, you guys got any other questions? Can't put this knife down, man. <laughs> it's that action. All about that action. Take a couple more questions. Or if there's any other knives that you want to see I might have laying around. Any of the new Benchmades, any of the other Benchmades I might have here. But to answer your question before, hopefully I answered it. 940 Osborne is my favorite Benchmade. What variant? Man, right now, this Titanium one is my favorite. But <laughs> Definitely, Nick, man. Buy it, put it in your hand, send me a picture. That'd be perfect. Uh, serial number on this 940? This one's 299. Yeah, exactly. Definitely, Nick. Oh, you got a handle one? Nice. Yeah, I looked at one when they first came out. The retail store Benchmade got one, the factory store there, and uh, they're beautiful. You know, they're like, hey, you want to at least check it out, handle it? I'm like, all right, all right. Just made me want it more. <laughs> you know, that's that's the first part of sales, man. Put it in their hand. Let them try it out, you know. Let them test drive it. Granted, you can't test drive new knives, but you guys know what I'm saying. That's why it's so nice. Like, they're one of the few knife retailers or knife manufacturers, sorry, yeah, they're great at that, Rito. They do awesome at that. You know, like you can walk in and anything that they have in production, you can literally be like, hey, man, I want to check this out. You know, it's like, all right, here you go. You check it out. You know, granted, you can buy one too. All right, sounds good, Nick. Have a good night. Thanks again. I'll probably wrap this up here in about 10 minutes or less, right about the hour mark, just because I want to, you know, get on, get on with, uh, going through my mail that you guys sent me so I can uh, sh get some stuff shipped out in the morning. But yeah, they're really good at that in there and really nice to just be able to handle the knives because there's been very few that I've been able to like say, oh, now I'm gonna pass on that one. But some of them I'm like, you know, you get it in your hand and you're like, gosh, that's fantastic, you know? Kind of like the, the Mediator was one. You know, I got, I got hands on with the mediator at SHOT Show and I'm like, man, this is like almost like a auto 940, a push button 940, you know? So slightly different design and everything, but yeah. And I know there's some mixed reviews on it. Oh, hit the, hit the tripod. Sorry about that. But it's one of those things where it's like, ah, oh, keep hitting it. <laughs> All right, I'll do it on camera up here. But it's one of those things where, you know, can't go wrong with it. It's got the mini bug out clip on it or the mini deep carry. Sorry. Go back to the, the bug out before it was a bug out. 530, 531. This is the 531. These G10 scales are fantastic. Uh, man, I really hope they do some scales like this on the bug out. You know, we've been kind of teased a little bit. What's up, Bunzo? Welcome back. Been teased a little bit with this guy. I'm really excited. And I hope they do the same milling pattern because this milling pattern is nice. Gives you a little bit of texture, but it's not rough. 
you know. Drop Shetty. The 20 CV. Saw a couple people die these. Which is it's alright, it's not bad. But yeah. Bad Monkey wrapped it up tonight in all awesome support of women carrying knives. Yeah, Sigs of Saline, you are right on the money there. If they put that in there, they better just, you know, tell all the people that are working in the factory, be like, we're canceling vacations because we got some knives, knives to, knife orders to fulfill. I think it's like that mini bug out, man. You know, I know Blade HQ had a problem just keeping them in stock and getting them. I don't know. I don't know all their things, but... Your knife collection video, is that the one you just posted today? Or in the last day? I think it's in my playlist. Hey, you're welcome. You are very welcome, Therapeutic Edge. They're out of the new bailouts now, okay. Oh, last night. No, it's in my playlist. I almost got a chance to watch it today, but I didn't get that long of a break. So I watched a few videos at lunch today. I'm just trying to get caught up, man. There's so many awesome things going on channel wise but I saw a couple of the beauty pageant ones too and I think I want in on that one so yeah <laughs> I don't doubt it man ribs are that's I bet they were amazingly delicious and that's what I'm talking about there get some good ribs going What's up from Guam? Grim Reaper. What's happening? Do a pocket dump. Oh, yeah, that's cool. I saw people are doing that. I like people doing kind of a daily pocket dump. And I'll tell you what. Rib coma. Yeah. I will tell you, they, to me, and this is just for me, doing one. Oh, yeah. Trip up. Some ribs. Heck yeah. We got a great place up here too. Uh, a great butcher block up here called Gartner's over in Portland. The delicious. We do some great short ribs. But I'll tell you. What was I talking about? <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, I forgot. What was it? It was back on a comment there. Oh yeah, the pocket dumps. So the pocket dump videos, if you make them like two, two and a half minutes... Or less, that's perfect. Yeah, definitely. Definitely, definitely. But that's one of the things for me, like, that's what made my decision easy. Because it's like, as I watch those, bam, bam. It's cool to see what people are carrying. Got a little video for some interaction. I dig that. I like that. Yeah, subscriber engagement. I don't want to copy you guys, though. But it's pretty easy to do, too. Oh, nice. You got one or two of them in stock there. That's cool. And here's the other scales that Three Rivers sent me. And just FYI, I mean, they're super awesome. But they sent me these Micarta ones in, like, the OD Green. So they this is the uh, this is something that they tossed in for me. So I'll, I'll bring that up in my video. But they were super cool to, to give me those as well, in addition to the red carbon fiber that I ordered. So that's why I had to order the the blue carbon fiber because I was like, you know what? I want to kind of pay it back too, definitely to them because they're pretty cool. But I do have one of their stickers from the other purchase. Saving for a car. Okay, there you go. That's pretty awesome stuff. I got those right there. Ready to roll. All right, you guys. Well, I think I'm going to wrap it up. You know, it's been an awesome night. Southern Edge Knife Works, they came in strong. Spiderco, Carbon Fiber Chaparral, they donated. Big Red, EDC, he donated his Toucan, his Toucan, Toucan. Awesome stuff. Oh, nice. Get a Tacoma. A lot of people have those. They really like them. That or the Forerunner. But yeah, so many cool things. You guys are amazing. I can't believe the awesomeness tonight. Nick, 
Thank you again for your donations. We go right back to the channel, right back to you guys. Randy, thanks for lo loaning me this so I can now put this on my list to buy one. And Nick, give me those fantastic ideas, uh, reinforcing that I need a gold class proper. So Benchmade, if you're listening, you know what's up. Hook me up. Give me a little hookup. <laughs> I'm just kidding. They're like, you're crazy. They're watching that. You're crazy. Hey, you are very welcome, Christine. I do need one, yes. I do need one for the collection, but that'd be so sweet to carry, too. Oh, man. Thank you so much, Therapeutic Edge. That is super nice. You're very cool. Very nice. You guys are all cool, but. Oh, thanks, Bunzo. Yeah, Ty Addiction. Have a great night, too. You guys enjoy. Definitely stay safe. I know a lot of people are staying at home. It's a rough time for everybody. So I'm trying to get a bunch of giveaways out this week. Uh, probably be doing a giveaway on my Instagram as well this week. So look out over there for that one. You guys have done something kind and it makes my heart warm and feels really, really nice. So thanks for you know taking care of me and taking care of Women Carry Knives and supporting our channels. And I will talk to you later this week. If you have questions, or these stickers are cool and you want something, or these little orange ones, let me know. Shoot me an email. Send me a message on Instagram. You guys have a fantastic rest of your week. Thank you so much, and take care.